Remember these eight categories of given conditions when solving triangles. See TR-27 for a review. They're all easy because the law of sines and the law of cosines are both easy, but one configuration is less easy than the others, and that's the one that can be denoted ASS, but more commonly and less comically as SSA. So you might still remember that solving these types of triangles is kind of a pain in the SSA. We're given two sides and an angle, but not the angle between the two sides. This configuration can have zero, one, or two solutions. Here's how that happens. We're given two sides, but we don't know the angle between them. You can think of a swivel at this point where the sides can rotate around. We're given an angle over here, side-side angle, but we don't know the length of this third side, just that it lies in this direction. We're going to cover some scenarios that involve various lengths of this swiveling side, which is always the side across from the given angle. The first scenario is when the swivel side is too short to reach the third side. This is the case of an SSA triangle having no solutions. If we let the swivel side get a little longer, we can just barely reach the third side at a right angle. This is an SSA triangle with one solution. If we let the swivel side get a little longer again, we reach a situation where it reaches the third side in two places. This means there are two triangles that have the given side-side angle configuration. They both have the same base side and angle, and the swiveling side can form a triangle two ways. So we have an SSA triangle with two solutions. Finally, we let the swiveling side get even longer, longer than the other given side. It can form a triangle up here, but when it swivels down, it's on the wrong side of the given angle's vertex, so there's no second triangle possible. So this is another SSA triangle with one solution. Solving an SSA triangle has the same requirements as solving any other triangle. Given three measurements, find and state clearly the other three. If there's no solution, say that. If there's one solution, present it clearly. If there are two solutions, present them both clearly. Only two tools are needed to solve SSA triangles. The law of sines that we covered in TR-28, and know that the sum of a triangle's angles is 180 degrees. In the next video, TR-31, we'll solve SSA triangles in each of these scenarios described here. It's a longer than average video, I pulled this section out to make it shorter.